The chart of the day is presented by Crypto.com, the leading crypto platform trusted by over 100 million users worldwide. Let's take a look at the chart of the day. Ethereum's layer twos are cumulatively profiting bigly in blue compared to the fees they pay in red to leverage the security of the layer one blockchain. Dune Analytics data shows layer twos, including Optimism, Arbitrum, Base, and others have made an 88% profit in the last year. Social media continues to buzz with debate over the imbalance in Ethereum's ecosystem, where layer two scaling products retain most of the generated revenue while contributing only a small percentage back to the foundational layer. Ethereum creator Vitalik Buterin has suggested encouraging L2s to essentially pay more in fees out of charity. Chainlink's Zach Ryan's pointing out this does not adjust the actual economics, but throws the problem back over the fence to the L2s to solve. And if they don't, there is social pressure saying they are not ETH aligned. The solution, he suggests, is scaling the L1 Ethereum blockchain, create native rollups and nationalize them. While Bitcoin, smart contract competitors Solana and others have hit all-time highs recently, Ethereum has been unable to near its record 4500 price it reached back in October 2021. Moreover, Solana continues to outshine Ethereum and other smart contract blockchains in decentralized exchange trading volumes and revenue. That's it for today's Chart of the Day. I'm Christine Lee. We'll see you next time to unpack more of the data behind top news stories.